Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we are having one very interesting and challenging question from radical simplification. Given equation is sixth root of x equal to cube root of x plus one over eighteen, and we have to simplify ninth root of x plus one over ninth root of x. X is in the denominator. Is straight away one thing we can write: x can't be zero. I will showcase two different ways to solve this problem. So let me write here. method number 1 and i will begin with cross multiplication to this equation given so i can write it is cube root of x plus 1 equal to 18 times sixth root of x now as x is non zero so i can divide both sides with sixth root of x so let's divide sixth root of x Sixth root of x. Sixth root of x. In RHS, we will cancel these two terms. So x power one by three minus one by six. So it would be sixth root of x plus one over sixth root of x equal to eighteen. This is actually our given equation. now i will use substitution in this method so if you will see 6 it is sixth root here it is ninth root so what i will consider i will consider the lcm of 6 and 9 which is 18 so i will consider 18th root of x equal to t this is our substitution in this method let or we can write x is equal to t power 18 so similarly i can write what would be sixth root of x it would be t cube what would be ninth root of x it would be t square so what is given actually in terms of t if i will write then i can write two equations first equation from actually given and second simplification equation basically for which we will find out right side so i will write this sixth root of x as t q plus 1 over t q this is 18 given and we have to find out this equation which is ninth root means t square so i will write t square plus 1 over t square we will calculate now task is easy this equation is known and this we have to find out let's consider one substitution t plus 1 over t let me write here t plus 1 over t equal to suppose a this is our assumption consider squaring of this equation so i will write t square plus 1 over t square plus 2 times t into 1 by t equal to a square so we can cancel these two so i can write from here t square plus 1 over t square is a square minus 2 done so this value we have to find out a square minus 2 let's consider cubing of this equation so i will consider t plus 1 over t whole cube this time so equal to a whole cube Let's apply a plus b whole formula. A cube plus one over a cube plus three ab. So t times one by t in bracket t plus one by t equal to a cube. Here I will be writing a t. This is our equation which we calculated. Plus this t and t will be over t plus one by t is a this was our substitution so i will write here 3a equal to a cube or a cube minus 3a minus 18 equal to 0 this is one cubic equation we will solve using factorization so a cube minus 3a minus 18 equal to 0 
I can split our central term or middle term minus 3a as minus 9a plus 6a minus 18 equal to 0. Now a is common. So we can write a square minus 9. 6 is common. So a minus 3 equal to 0. Now here we can apply the difference of two squares. a square minus 3 square. So I can write a a minus 3 a plus 3 plus 6 a minus 3 equal to 0. Now a minus 3 is common. So I can write a minus 3. What is left? a times a plus 3 plus 6. Right hand side is 0. a square plus 3a plus 6. And here we can write a minus 3 equal to 0. Now f dot g equal to 0. That means f equal to 0. So I will write either a minus 3 equal to 0. So from here a is equal to 3. Now from this quadratic we can say delta. First find out delta discriminant. b square minus 4ac. So b square is 3 square minus 4ac. So this is 9 minus 24 which is minus 15 negative complex solution will generate. So this equation is rejected for our solution. So which is accepted it is a equal to 3. So our required expression was t square plus 1 over t square. So let me write here t square plus 1 over t square was a square minus 2. What is a? a is 3. So our answer of this expression equal to 3 square is 9 minus 2. So answer is 7. Let's consider method number 2. Method number 2 I will write equation the 6th root. 6th root of x plus 1 over 6th root of x equal to 18. Now I will consider squaring of this equation. Let me demonstrate. Square, square. So I can write 6th root of x whole square. So it would be cube root of x. 1 over 6 root of x whole square. So 1 over cube root of x and then plus 2 equal to 18 square 3 2 4. Now I will write cube root of x plus 1 over cube root of x equal to 3 double 2. So this equation is known now. Now if you will see this is unknown. So I will consider this unknown equal to suppose a. Let us consider this unknown expression is a. Now I will consider cube of this equation. Let me write here 9th root of x plus 1 over 9th root of x equal to a. a is our consideration. Now I will consider whole cube both sides. See 9th root of x whole cube. So it will be cube root of x. 1 over 9th root of x. So it would be cube root of x. Plus 3ab. So 3 only. In bracket. 9th root of x plus 1 over 9th root of x which is a equal to a cube. So from here we will put this equation value. So here we can write it is equal to 322 plus 3a equal to a cube. So this is one cubic equation. Let me write here a cube minus 3a minus 322 equal to 0. Now we have to solve this cubic equation. I will use rational root theorem first. 
so if i will find out the eligible factors of this constant term 322 so i can write plus minus 1 plus minus 2 plus minus 7 and plus minus 23 it is prime so here we won't get after that factorization leading factors plus minus 1 only so what i will see i can see x is equal to 1 and 2 it won't satisfy as 322 is very big number let us begin with a equal to 7 so i will write 7 cube minus 3 times 7 minus 322 7 cube is 343 minus 21 and minus 322 yes it is 0 343 with plus sign 343 with minus sign so a equal to 7 is our base solution now i will use sdm so i need to write all the coefficient of cubic equation 1 0 minus 3 minus 322 put one line over there one as it is 7 times 1 7 7 49 46 7 times 46 3 2 2 0 so equation would be a square plus 7a plus 46 equal to 0 let's check only discriminant so that we can confirm whether solutions are real or complex so delta b square so 49 minus 4ac 4 times 46 so it is coming out negative no need to check complex solutions so we will reject this equation so which solution is accepted solution it is a equal to 7 now what we will write our answer so this is a the required expression was a so our answer becomes 7 9th root of x plus 1 over 9th root of x equal to 7. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe friends. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.